This is a short guide on how to play RPG Maker games on the Miu Mini and the Miu Mini Plus using Onion OS. Onion OS includes the Easy RPG Live Retro Core, which will let you play games made in RPG Maker 2000 and RPG Maker 2003. This is an experimental core, however, for Onion OS, so not all games will run smoothly. For example, I was testing out the uh, the Crimson Eclipse. And while you can play it, it has massive slowdowns during battle sequences. You'll have to see how well games run on a game by game basis. To start with, this guy will assume you already have Onion OS. I go over how to install Onion OS on almost every guide, so I'm going to skip this step for this video. If you need help, please feel free to leave a comment or refer to my written slash video guide linked below. Installing Easy RPG is very easy when using Onion OS. Easy RPG is already included as a RetroArch core with Onion OS. You can load the Easy RPG core just like any other core in the RetroArch menu. If you don't want to use RetroArch, we can install the Easy RPG shortcut using the package manager and it will be available in the Expert Shortcut app. Once in Onion OS, Navigate to the Apps folder and start the Package Manager. Press R1 to navigate to the Apps tab. From here, make sure Expert Shortcut is enabled, as this is how we'll be accessing Easy RPG. Press R once more to navigate to the Expert tab in Package Manager. Scroll down to Game Engine Easy RPG and make sure it is enabled. Press start twice to save the changes and exit the package manager. Now we can access Easy RPG through the expert shortcut. Let's say you don't want to go through the tedium of having to go through apps, expert shortcut, and then Easy RPG. You can simply copy the Easy RPG folder in the R app directory on your SD card into the MU directory. This will let you start Easy RPG from the games folder like the rest of your emulators. It's just a file to launch the Live Retro Core, and as far as I can tell, doing this causes no issues. After Easy RPG is installed, our next step is to install our RPG Maker games. To clarify again, Easy RPG supports games made in RPG Maker 2000 and 2003. So if you're playing games made with later versions, it may not work. Also the core is marked as experimental by the Onion devs, so even supported games may not run properly. The devs recommended having your game files be zipped to have the best chance of working. I tested out WinRAR files as is, and WinRAR files renamed to .zip files and they would not work, so you'll have to use a program like 7-zip to extract and then repackage the files as zip files to get them to work. You can extract the contents and then load the exe file manually from Easy RPG as well, but I found this to be cumbersome, so I opted to zip the files. We'll use the Thea installation as an example. I downloaded the file from the webpage as shown here. It's a Rinwar file and it won't work as is. I use 7-zip to extract the contents. You can download 7-zip from here. After 7-zip is installed, right click on the file, go to 7-zip, extract files. After extracting, I navigated to the folder containing the game files, and then use 7-zip to package it into a zip file. Right click on the folder you want to package, go to 7-zip, and then add to archive. Once the 7-zip interface pops up, just make sure the archive format section is set to zip. The rest you can leave as default. Press OK to create your zip file. Do this step for every game you want to play that isn't in a .zip format. When you're done zipping all your files, copy them to your micro SD card. The directory for Easy RPG is in SD, ROMs, and Easy RPG. Once the files are done copying, you're ready to play the games. If you're wondering where to find recommendations for games, I found them on YouTube, Reddit, and the RPG Maker forums. They're available on itch.io as well. 
Once you boot to Onion OS, go into the Games folder. Before starting Easy RPG, press Select once to bring up the option to refresh all ROMs. Press A on this to refresh the ROMs list so we can see our newly added games. Go to Easy RPG and start it. Pick the game you want to play and it should launch. Just keep in mind not all games will run properly. Here are a few things you can double check if your games are not launching. Make sure you have the RPG underscore RT dot INI file as well as the RPG underscore RT dot LDB file inside your zip files. If these files are missing, your game may not launch. It's also possible the game installation has some files corrupted. Try re-downloading and re-zipping the files. Make sure the archive format is set to zip for 7-zip. Other formats may not work. Other than that, it probably comes down to the game not working properly on the core as it is still in an experimental state for Onion OS. Overall, I think the Easy RPG core is pretty neat. Not all games will run well, but for the games that do, it lets you play fan-made games, and some are quite fantastic. It expands the library for playable games on the handheld, and I'm always amazed at what these tiny devices can do. Anyways, that's going to be it. Thank you for watching, and hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment down below. As always, hope you guys are staying safe and sane out there. And catch you guys next time.